amalgamation, absorption, and reconstruction. Let us look at the meaning for amalgamation. In case of amalgamation, two or more companies go into liquidation to form one company. So there are two or more liquidations and one formation in case of amalgamation. Next is absorption. In case of absorption, an existing joint stock company take over the business of a company which is going to be liquidated and a new company is formed. So in case of absorption, there is one liquidation and one formation. In case of reconstruction, a financially weaker company is strengthened by taking certain measures to avoid closure. There are two forms of reconstruction. One is external reconstruction, another one is internal reconstruction. In case of external reconstruction, a financially weaker company goes into liquidation and a new company is formed and the business is carried on under a new name. So there is one liquidation and one formation. In case of internal reconstruction, there is no liquidation and there is also no formation because there is only production of share capital. Next is purchase consideration. Purchase consideration is the amount paid by the purchasing company to vendor company. As per accounting standard 14, purchase consideration for amalgamation is the amount paid to the shareholders of vendor company in the form of cash, shares or debentures. According to accounting standard 14, payment made to shareholders should not be considered for calculating purchase consideration. Let us now look out the methods for calculating purchase consideration. There are four methods to calculate purchase consideration. They are net payment method, net asset method, lump sum method and intrinsic value method. But basically two methods are followed to calculate purchase consideration and those two methods are net payment method and net asset method. First is net payment method. In case of net payment method, purchase consideration is calculated by adding all the payments made to the shareholders of the vendor company that which may be made in the form of cash or shares or debentures. Next, next is net asset method. In this method, purchase consideration is equal to agreed value of assets taken over by the purchasing company minus agreed value of liabilities taken over by the purchasing company.